I found a very cool insect this week. Meet the stick insect. Really popular exotic pets for good reason. For instance, just look at this guy. Certainly a unique creature. But what makes it so? Stick insects belong to the order Phasmatodia, which also contains their cousins, the leaf insects. Both are classified into different families in the order, which is actually named after the Greek word for ghosts, Phasma. Their camouflage is certainly ghost-like, as they are almost indistinguishable from the branches and leaves on which they spend their time. Let's get back to our stick insect over here. I will not be keeping this guy by the way. It is still not an adult as it lacks wings or wing scars. Stick insects undergo what is known as incomplete metamorphosis, wherein the young, known as nymphs, look like miniature versions of adults as it lacks a pupil stage. And I found this guy to be missing a leg, but don't worry, it will grow back in a few molds. And did you know that the longest insect measures 64 centimeters in length and is a species of stick insect? As a temporary setup, I made use of a large jar filled with twigs and eucalyptus leaves for the insect to eat. I am looking forward to learning more about these fascinating creatures. They are also liked by the general public, especially children. And this, along with their relatively easy care, makes them excellent pets. Any of you guys who have experience with keeping them, please do comment below. So far, what I do know is that their food supply should be kept fresh, their enclosure should be set up in an arboreal fashion, and that they require a lot of humidity. You see, very easy care. Stick insects are also really easy to acquire, as they are found in all continents except for Antarctica. Keep an eye out for them when exploring your yard or a garden. Until next time, ABSE Adventurers, you can stay notified for future uploads by subscribing to the channel and further supporting the channel by sharing this video. This is ABSE signing out. Take care and goodbye.